Time to overreact to Championship Sunday. What is there to say? This will likely go down as the worst officiated Championship Sunday ever. But if you're a fan of chaos and just pure, insane entertainment, this weekend was incredible. As unpredictable as many moments were this weekend, the same old narratives played out in Kansas City. Tom Brady came in clutch, and the Chiefs season ended in absolutely heartbreaking fashion. After trailing 14-0 at half, Patrick Mahomes, even with 39 seconds left, down three, he kept them alive. But in OT, Brady never let him get back on the field. And like in years past, it was Edelman and Gronk making crucial catch after crucial catch. And like in years past, Andy Reid will not win a Super Bowl. And to think, if D Ford stayed on sides, this would be a different story. But there is no overreacting to the non-pass interference call in New Orleans. What was obvious to everyone was missed by the guys who needed to see it the most, the refs. This will go down as one of the worst missed calls in NFL history. Fail Mary, Des caught it, immaculate reception if you think it wasn't, tuck rule, all bow down to the NFL's newest biggest blunder. One that gutted the Saints and gave the Rams the window they needed to sneak out of NOLA with a stunning victory. Sean McVay in his second year as coach has taken the Rams to the Super Bowl and LA has their first appearance as a city since 1984. And all of those very dicey moves in the offseason have paid off. Yes, even you, Marcus Peters. And as for the Saints, look at the bright side. The Minneapolis Miracle is now the second most devastating loss in New Orleans history. Sean Payton had a call with officiating after the game and they admitted that they blew it. The refs playing a little, is it too late to say I'm sorry? But they've made these mistakes, not once, not twice. It feels like a hundred times. And as for the NFL, this is a mess that they really can't clean up. But hopefully this brings about real change to the way that they evaluate officiating. And maybe, just maybe, they consider extra oversight. Whether they allow coaches to challenge these calls or the New York headquarters to review these controversial plays. And the whole pass interference is a judgment call argument, that should be put to bed forever. Just show them this. Because the only ones that we're judging now are the refs. For Saints fans, Sean Payton was right. You will never get over this. At least the Rams found some humor in the matter. And now we have the Rams and the Patriots in the Super Bowl. A rematch of the first Super Bowl Tom Brady ever played. Put this into perspective, Sean McVay was 16 when that happened. A lot has changed, but what hasn't changed? The Patriots sustained dominance during that time period. And in the meantime, stick with sports polls. Your heartbeat to what's trending in sports.